What is up guys? Welcome back to another video. So in today's video, I am going to be talking about um two things that have um been released over well, they've pretty much been released the day I'm recording this video. And by released, I mean uh, they were tweeted about on Twitter by the news. Twitter users, you know, Bloxy News and Roblox RTC, and also don't mind me playing Speedrun 4 Classic, okay? I, th I thought it'd be good for some gameplay footage. So, um, yeah, before we hop into the video, make sure you guys, uh, smash that like button, and also, uh, if you haven't yet, make sure to subscribe, and also make sure to turn on your notifications so you guys don't miss any brand new videos. So, pretty much, um, what's been released on Twitter is, first of all, Walmart has their own sponsored Roblox game that is an Xbox compatible, similar to a few uh, other sponsored games on Roblox, so, um, that kind of stinks. And then I also found this Roblox game called Walmart Tycoon. It wasn't, like, created by Walmart or anything, but it seems pretty interesting, so I might as well, uh, shout out the game. So, yeah, there's that little bit of news. And overall, I, uh, I, I, I don't really know what to say about this. I mean, I guess it's a pretty good sponsor. I mean, getting sponsored by, like, one of the most popular stores is a pretty big achievement, I guess. Um, so yeah, overall, I'm not, I, I don't really care too much for this. If it was on Xbox, I probably would have cared for it a little bit more, but I don't know, I don't really care uh, too much about this. Now, the second thing, though, is actually even more interesting than the first. So, Dynamic Faces are actually coming to Roblox. I don't know if they're released on the platform for all the players now. Maybe they're just released for some people, like the developers, or maybe like the tester, testing people, but yeah, pretty much, pretty soon, dynamic faces are going to be coming to Roblox. So, these, dy these dynamic faces, pretty much what you're able to do is whenever you like do an emote, let's say for example there's a confused emote, then your face would act confused instead of staying as like the default smile whenever you do the confused emote. And then uh, your face would probably turn happier, maybe it open its mouth or something if um, you're doing like the monkey emote for example. So, I'll actually show some photos of this on the screen from the video on Twitter. But yeah, overall though, I think this change is going to be pretty good for Roblox. I thought at first that this was only going to be for voice chat, but since it's also for emotes, I am pretty happy about it. Um, I think, I honestly think that this is a good change for Roblox. It really allows, like, your avatar to be more expressive, and yeah, I, uh, I like this update. I, uh, think it's good. So, um, yeah, guys, that is, um, all the news that I have to offer for, um, right now. Actually, one more thing. For, uh, anyone that is, um, being hit by a hurricane right now in Florida, I just want to say, um, stay safe out there. But yeah, guys, I hope you guys all enjoyed this video. If you guys haven't yet, make sure to smash that like button, subscribe, turn on your notifications. Make sure to subscribe or else I will not give you cookies. Okay? So yeah, make sure to subscribe and I will see you guys next time. Peace out. Whew.